Hey everybody, Richter Knives here, your favorite knife tuber, episode number 78. Today we're going to have a look at this 56 GC, I don't know how to say it, Rosewood. And we've got the Lord's Drink. It's been about 12 days since I made a video because the guy's busier than a three-tailed cat. Got the leather work, got the full-time job, all the stuff. But we're going to get into it. And uh, we're going to make a good video. Let me take a drink of this. Ready? One, two, seven. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, it burned. That's good. Let's check it out. Okay, before we check out the knife, let's check out the two. This is what she says. 562123EO. The EO stands for easy open. I don't know if that's Chichen. Chichen. Rosewood. You know what I'm saying. Northfield Unexcelled. This is the fancy schmancy version. Premium hand tested. Frozen Forge 1095 Carbon Steel. Yep, Great Eastern Cutlery. Tysville, Pennsylvania. Um, I've seen folks struggling to open these. Let me show you something real quick. You see the end of this thing? If you stick it right there and just pull up, you can open that very easily. Or if you don't have little sissy hands, you could just kind of grab it and pull it too. Just a heads up. Here we go. Here's a knife. All right. I've been toting this thing for maybe mm, a week-ish, somewhere around there. Um, I have uh, used my TC Barlow as well, but this one has been in my pocket most of the time. And a uh, neat thing about this is it already came, like you've seen, with the easy open. So, that's good. Because this one, the long, in my opinion, the long pulls don't open as easy as something like a nail nick. Right? Uh, something like this nail nick on a 56, which I had before, you can just kind of get your thumb meat in there. Yeah. Open it on up and pinch it out. But this one... You can't get your thumb meeting there very good. I mean, I guess you could, but that just adds a easier way to open it, right? This does not have a half stop. This is on a cam tank, so that's cool. It's got it's you can barely see now. See it right there, Northfield unexcelled, and that's pretty good. Y'all, excuse the wind. The sound's probably terrible, but she's windy out here today. You can see where my thumbs have kind of wore the teeners off from opening it. See? Right there. Kind of like in a circle pattern where my thumb is. She's got the switch. Spear point blade. Let's look at the... Uh, here we go. The stamp. Northfield Unexcelled. Titusville, PA. Nice. This side... As your model number and GC, and I think it says CAR or carbon underneath there, or carbon steel. As you can see, she's got the teeners, all of them. And uh, it came duller than a spoon, but I took care of that. She's sticky now. Fruit roll up sticky. Mm hmm. Cherry flavor. And it's got the cloud shield, which I've never, I don't think I've ever owned a cloud shield before. But I want you to take a look at this wood right here. The chin 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 chin, chin rosewood. This is beautiful. Look at the grain up in that dude with the brass. This is just fancy. A bit of fluting on the bolsters. A little bit of pinching on the bolsters. Boop. She's bareheaded too, if you can see that. No cap centered strike right down the middle uh let's do some size comparisons boop okay oh y'all hear gunshots duck duck and run all right 
this is the 85 beaver and it's a little bigger you can see that that uh blade is a whole lot bigger oh another gunshot um this is the 15 i just showed you all ago 15 pattern boys knife huckleberry boys knife that's pretty close it's a little longer and ye old case sway back mm -hmm. so there's your comparisons um i like this knife this is really cool knife i love the way it looks i like the size of it it's just a great second what kind of creature are you i don't know a great second pocket knife you know secondary pocket knife i usually carry a modern folder in my right pocket clip to my right pocket and then a traditional down in my right pocket most of the time with a slip i love the brass on this thing i love the way this looks uh, i don't care that it doesn't have a half stop i really like this actually my very first gc was a, a number 56 it was the brown mustard flavor right this one looks very cool though lord's drink break hold on mm -mm -mm. all that yakking makes my throat dry love this knife it's a good carry I love the shape of the blade. The carbon steel gets very sharp, very easily. I put a, I put it to a work sharp uh, field sharpener. That's all it needed. Didn't even use the coarse side diamond. Uh, that puts a 20 degree edge on it. So, you know, it's not got this big honking, shiny, bevel on it but it's sharp i promise you so have a look at that i just kind of wanted to show you all this so what are y'all toting i don't know go check out my instagram if you're not already uh following me on instagram i post a lot more on instagram than i do on youtube the YouTube, I just kind of use them hand in hand together. Uh, Instagram and YouTube. Just because I like to post pictures. And I think the reels are a whole lot easier on Instagram. Or are they even called reels? Or are they called shorts? I don't know. I just work here. Anywho. One more look around this knife. Yep. Look right here, man. Right here. It's like your finger belongs there. Love it. All right. Put down in the comments what you think about this knife. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, like I said. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's that little red button down there. Like it. All the good stuff. And don't forget to tell your friends. Tell your girlfriend, tell your crush, tell your mom and them, tell your barber about Richter Knives. And this is Richter 56.